up welcome back to summer in the city day two i just finished my cup of coffee for the day the way i was holding that coffee cup that's gross <laughs> um i just did my planner for the day and i got some work done i got my thumbnail and some other stuff done for my vlog going up today because yesterday i started this amazing series and i'm having so much fun with it i'm so glad you guys are liking it um today's gonna be another fun day i literally have something planned every single day for you guys to just do fun new summer city things um and hopefully even if you don't live in new york city this inspires you to kind of look into what your city has to offer because there is a lot you just kind of have to put an effort in which sometimes is not fun but it's worth it anyways it's time for breakfast and i'm so hungry um and i wanted to show you guys a breakfast that i've been loving recently i've showed it before well, actually, this is dependent on if I have any ripe avocados. Mm. Okay, I, I think this one can work, but, like, I don't want to be let down. That's okay. We're going to try it. I am obsessed with eggs. Well, I'm just going to show you guys. So basically, what you need for this breakfast, <laughs> I'm a chef now telling you how to make things. This is what I do. It's such a good, it's a filling breakfast, but not, like, too filling. Like, you feel like crap when you wake up. Like, it is such a great breakfast and it's refreshing and delicious tortillas usually i get like small tortillas texas peat hot sauce or just hot sauce and then i use two eggs and an avocado i'm gonna do a little preparing over here and then we'll check back in okay so first i will just scramble two eggs and i just sprayed some avocado oil here fun fact about me <laughs> Well, actually, my old roommate in college, <laughs> that sounds so funny, my old roommate, um, taught me this because I always would, like, scramble my eggs in a bowl, and then it's like a whole bowl is wasted, and she was like, just scramble them in the pan. So I always do that now. I just make sure to use, like, a rubber thing so it doesn't, like, you know, I don't, I wouldn't use a fork because it'll kind of ruin your pan, especially if you have, like, one of those non-stick ones like this. This is the scan pan. I got it on Amazon. It's the best thing ever, and I just scramble away before I, like, turn the pan on because if you don't scramble right away then it cooks and then it gets weird okay eggs are done I'm gonna take a tortilla I personally just like flour tortillas better boom and I do two eggs because oh because I feel like three wouldn't fit in a small tortilla even this is kind of a lot but it tastes real good then i'll put some texas peat hot sauce ryan got me onto this hot sauce um but whatever hot sauce you like it, this is the only time i use hot sauce i literally never use hot sauce in my life except for this and then we've got the avocados and then the final thing i do in order to eat this i prefer having salt and pepper on my avocados because it just makes them a lot more tastier that's what they do at restaurants and voila it's delicious and fills me up for a while pool day makeup i just did use my refi brow gel just so my brows are in place i love that stuff so much gotta use my super goop glow screen and i'm obviously bringing it to reapply super goop summer i'm telling you guys i love this stuff because it gives your skin a little bit of a glow they also just came out with golden hour which has a little bit more tint to it i used it last night at dinner i'm not sponsored by super goop but they do gift me a lot and I'm really appreciative because it's summer and I love their sunscreen so much. Super Goop actually is the one who gave me tickets to GovBall this weekend. So I'm so excited I get to go. And I think they have like a stand or something like a pop-up at GovBall, which will be fun. And then I might as well put some sunscreen on my lips too. This is the Super Goop Unseen like lip sheer or something. Mmm, it's minty. I like it a lot. My summer perfume, Melon and Goetz Vetiver. All right, hair, we're gonna do a slick back because that's all I do these days. All right, this'll do. Use my boar bristle brush from Amazon. I'm just gonna claw clip it actually because I wanna be obnoxious and just wear a ton of green. Green MEJ clip. Yay! Hopefully that looks okay, I don't know. I fully plan to get in this pool. Did I tell you guys I'm going to the pool today? I swear, I did not. Wow, okay. We're doing a pool day. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so I guess I, I think I forgot in this vlog to tell you guys we're going to the pool. Also, I just got this uh, Tiji bedhead. It's the hair stick. I saw it on TikTok. And, oh, ooh, go down. I, I don't know, I've heard this stuff is pretty good. 
to like slick back your flyaways. Oh wow, feels like glue. Okay, well, not taking my hair down now. Oh, this is really cool. Like for flyaways, oh my God, if it works on my back, baby hairs will cry because these make me so frustrated. Yeah, this literally is like a glue stick you use like in school. My hair's on that. That's great. Um, I'll link this below. It's from Amazon and it came in a pack of two and I'm going to give the second one to Kelly because um, I sent her the TikTok. She was like, I need to try it. And I was like, <laughs> got you one already. All right. So <laughs> guess I forgot to tell you guys. So let's go out there. When I was home in Florida, I was laying by the pool and I was like, this is so nice. I can't wait to do it when I'm in New York. And I was like, wait, why would I do it in New York? Like, I don't have a pool, obviously, whatever. So it made me think. So I looked up like ways to like pools in New York or like how to go to a pool for a day in New York City. And I found this website, not sponsored, called resortpass.com and they also have an app. <laughs> I went ham on this. This is not only a New York City thing, this is all over the country. I mean, when I was in Florida, I could go on resort pass and see resorts near me. Basically, you can get like day passes to resorts near you, like a pool, or you can use their amenities. They have like different passes. So I was so pumped, because there are a few hotels here in New York City that do have pools, have poolside service, like that vibe. Um, and I'm obviously not staying in a hotel in New York City unless I'm doing like a staycation or something. Um, so um, I texted my friend Katie, Katie Bellotti, and I was like, do you want to do a pool day with me today? Um, a couple, like last week, we planned this week ago. And she was like, yes, I'm so down. So today's pool that we're trying is the William Vale Hotel Pool. Um, it's in Brooklyn. It's like 15 minute drive from Lower East Side. So we thought it was perfect. I'm so excited. We actually rented a day bed. They didn't have any more like just chairs available. So her and I are splitting a day bed and I think Adam, her friend Adam, my friend Adam, I guess now I love him so much, Adam Harrison, is coming too, um, like a little bit later. So yeah, I don't really know. We're gonna get like lunch there, lay by the pool. I'm charging up my Kindle right now. We're gonna read. Um, so this is today's activity. Well, actually we're doing more tonight, but this is the first activity of the day. We're doing a pool day. Sorry, I didn't say that earlier. Wow. I thought it'd be fun to pack my pool bag with you guys and do like a little what's in my pool bag. OG YouTuber watchers know I used to do like what's in my beach bag? What's in my pool bag? What's in my backpack? Like stuff like that and I still love that shit So like why aren't we doing it anymore? My aunt Debbie gave me this because obviously we both have the same initial She's like you can use it for groceries in New York, but I was like this is a great little beach bag today So what's in my beach bag you may or pool bag you may ask? <laughs> Lots of sunscreen. I was in Tampa for two weeks and I got tan and no burn like no peeling never burn because I was reapplying and I it showed, it showed itself, you know, like I now know the true importance of sunscreen. Um, I've just been realizing it a lot, researching a lot more about it, like on my face especially. <clears throat> so we're bringing banana boat, SPF 30, sun bum, sunscreen oil. Sun bum is my favorite sunscreen, like um, body spray sunscreen, but I didn't have it. So, and then for my face, it's super group summer. I also have glow screen for your body, but I don't know where that is actually. Um, I'm bringing this super goop resetting refreshing mist. I think it has yeah, it's SPF 40 and you like spray it on To like refresh your sunscreen Glow screen and then the lip balm that I'm using lots of sunscreen Gonna bring my wallet obviously Sunglasses I'm gonna go with my Ray-Bans today cuz I don't if I'm tanning tanning I don't want to wear like super thick sunglasses cuz then I get a weird tan line I'm pretty sure Katie and I are gonna be like chatting but in case we want to unplug or plug in I'm gonna bring my airpods hand sanitizer, um, Summer Fridays lip balm. This has like a little tint to it. Um, so I'll put that over my little super goop sunscreen lip stuff because it just gives you some color, you know? And then I don't like smelling bad. So I'm bringing the replica beach walk perfume or no, is this beach walk? No, this is autumn vibes, but it smells really good. It doesn't like smell like fall. And it's that time in the month. So tampons. Also bringing a hairbrush um, for like when I get out of the pool. I, one of the reasons I got my hair extensions out is because I was like, I want to be able to go underwater um, and just like have fun and not worry about my hair. So I'm that girl that goes underwater. I pray other people get in this pool because I might be that one girl that like splish splash. Well, I know Katie wants to get into. And then got to bring my Kindle. Of course, I'm reading um, The Summer I Turned Pretty right now. Um, so I'm very excited because it come, the series comes out really soon. Gonna, I'm just going to put this on. This is my little tank that I'm gonna wear. It's from the brand Hours on Revolve. I love it. I should have put this on before I did my hair. <sighs> oh, here we go. Ugh. Oh, shoot. Got my lips on there, like things are happening. 
Oh no. <sighs> Guys, that was so silly of me. Oh well, okay. This is like my favorite hat to wear while tanning because it like, like when you lay back on the chair, it bends with it rather than like, you're like, ah, I can't lay down <laughs> like a puppet right now. Um, so yeah, this hat is from Revolve. <sighs> Chaotic energy this morning. <laughs> this hat's from Revolve. Um, I'll link below. I love it. It's so cute on. As for my outfit, I'm gonna have to get this stain out. I'm just wearing the Monday swimwear set and then I'm wearing these pants that I got from Cabana South in Tampa. But I feel like you just, if you just look up like white linen pants, these are like beach pants, obviously. Like I wouldn't just wear them because you could see my bathing suit underneath. Um, and then I just have on like my everyday jewelry. This bracelet Katie actually got for me. I'll have to ask her where it's from. I've been wearing it for like two weeks. This is from the Little Words Project. Pura Vida and Pura Vida and then hair tie, which I guess I'll bring. That's my beach bag. I'll probably throw like a water bottle in there as well, but I'm assuming they'll also have water there. Um, Woo. Okay, stain wasn't coming out, so we just sprayed some shout on her and she'll be going in the wash. So I just threw over this button up. This is easier anyway, so I don't have to pull it over my hair again. Um, I just got this the other day at Zara. I posted a Zara haul on TikTok and Instagram reels. If you guys don't follow me, go follow me. But um, yeah, I am obsessed with this. This is a size medium from Zara. This color, fabulous. All right, we just got to the hotel. I'm here with Katie. We're going up. We're going up to the pool. This is gorgeous, the William Vale Hotel. Okay guys, we just got here. This is literally so sick. I'm obsessed, heaven. It's a good spot if it's not like sceney, you know, like you can just like actually lay by the pool and chill. I mean, maybe on the weekends it's different. It's super windy though. This is the menu. They have chicken tenders. Chicken tenders by the pool is always a good idea. Oh my god, they have a Caesar salad. Oh, they don't have a wrap though. You wanted a wrap. They can make it a wrap. Oh my gosh, it's so windy though. All right, by the pool. We've got our suits on. Vibes are good. Very windy today. That's okay. It's not raining. We just got chicken tenders and fries. I'm so excited. They gave us some in to go boxes because it's really it's, windy. We're gonna lose some chicken tenders. <laughs> the mic is just screaming right now. So yeah, about to dive into these, tan it up, get in the pool. Vibes are right, so summer in the city. <laughs> got some sparkling water. Sparkling water, if you're ever just in the mood, oh my god, and this ice is the best kind of ice. Chick-fil-A ice. Chick-fil-A ice, literally. To glamorize your life a little bit, just get some sparkling water. We just went in the pool. We went underwater. It was a little cold, a little but bit. it feels. I feel really good now. I feel very refreshed. Me too. It feels so nice. Oh, now we're gonna read and relax. Maybe get back in the pool. We love it. She got a diet coke. That looks so good. It's a fake diet coke. It's not real. It's but not real I coke. Can't tell. She doesn't know. Beautiful. All right, we're heading out. It's been so lovely. Goodbye, William Vale. Bye. Vibes. Oh, this is so windy. Alright, we're headed back to Lower East Side, to our respective apartments. And the day's not over. No. <laughs> it's just begun. It's just begun. <laughs> um, we're gonna go home shower. Nothing better than like a post pool shower. We Nothing love that. Nothing better. All sun kissed. A little bit of sun. Yeah, I got a little bit of sun. Yes, you did. So I did love you. it. And then uh, we're gonna go to an event with Summer Water tonight. Summer Club, to be summer, specific. Summer Club. Well, it's Summer Water, you're right. Summer but Water. It's at Summer Club. At Summer Club. It looks very Hamptons y. Katie's having me at her cabana. We have a cabana. My sugar mama. I hope we have a cabana boy, too. Yeah, a little cabana boy. That'd <laughs> be very fun. It's gonna be fun. Drink some Summer Water, which is like rose. And uh, it should be fun. And get some more chicken nuggets. Get some more chicken nuggets. Colby's coming. Colby. It's gonna be fun. We're gonna get all dressed up. I'm yes. excited. I got a shower, though. Got things to do here. <laughs> So, also I wanted to update you guys. The pool was amazing, highly suggest. It was such a nice little, like little break from the work day. Yeah. Like, just like four hours sitting, we could still see our phones. Like, under, yeah, under we were still so responding to emails. Like, <laughs> but getting some sun, some vitamin D. It was so nice, so I highly suggest they're also obviously available on the weekends too. 
resort pass not sponsored i just like went on there and it's a great hotel the pool was great it was calm it wasn't like party party like you could just like relax and like get in the pool and order food it was, just it was really nice the staff so nice. they were so nice so nice as soon as we walked in they were like complimenting us i like want to go back just for them they were very sweet. i know i know we need to get the same very people sweet. it was a little windy today which was annoying at times so you, you guys probably could tell in the microphone but yeah. it kept us not as hot, which was nice. And it wasn't yeah, I didn't raining. even realize I was getting color because it was so like windy. Breezy, yeah. But There's also a bar on the top of the William Vale. Oh yeah, she's been FYI, there. FYI, you can go for like a date. So like this is the perfect date. Just yes. go to the either the bar and then go to the pool for like a sunset situation or vice versa. Oh, it'd be so cute. What yeah. a cute date. So cute. So I just want to tell you guys, the results are in. It was great. And I'm so happy. Yay! All right, we are ready for the event. I'm so happy. If you guys watched yesterday's vlog, day one, which you definitely should, I was saying I don't have anywhere to wear this dress yet, but I'll find something. <laughs> Tonight is the night. It's called, it's like the attire is summer cocktail night out. Katie's also wearing something similar, so I was like, okay, this is what we'll do. I'll link this dress below. It's from Revolve. It's so flattering. I love the high cut. So cute. Love a midi dress. I'm wearing my hair in a side part today. Let me know what you guys think. I feel like... My hair is actually not that short without my extensions, but for some reason I was feeling the side part with this moment, but you guys tell me. I know like middle parts in, but earrings are from 5 and 2 Jewelry. I just did like light glowy makeup, and then I'm wearing these shoes. They're so comfortable. They're from Dolce Vita. They're the platform version of the Pally heels, so I don't remember what these are called, but they're just like a little bit more platform. Um, yay. I love it, and then gonna bring this purse that I'm renting from Vivrell right now. Getting a lot of use out of the purse. I'm so, so excited. And then, so it's at this place called Summer Club, which I'm so excited about. It looks stunning. Um, me, Katie, and Colby are gonna go. I'm hoping they have dinner there. I have not eaten. Um, <laughs> I think they do. And then when we're done with that, we're gonna like watch the sunset over there. It's gonna be so pretty. And then we're gonna head over to um, like a local bar over here in the Lower East Side, East Village, and watch the end of the I call it the lightning game, but everyone here is calling it the Rangers game because I'm a lightning fan. Um, hockey, lightning versus Rangers, Tampa versus New York, um, and Ryan and his roommate is going to be there. So yeah, I mean, we're going to attempt. I'm going to be literally in this, but it's okay. They'll, they'll understand. I think Katie's almost here. She's picking me up in her Uber. But yeah, I'm excited. We're transporting to the phone now. Yes, it's actually, oh. actually Fetty Wap is on it. I love it. We're headed to the Grayson to finish the watching the hockey game. Go Bolt, sorry about it. Sorry. All right, we are now going to a sports bar, fully dressed up. We're overdressed. At least we're all together, that's what matters. Oh, lots of people. I'm gonna put my camera away. Up in a click of yes, a click of overdressed. All right, here we go. They're towards the back. What a day today has been. I'm just already loving summer in the city. Like I was talking to some people today and everyone's just like wants to do stuff all the time. And I love it because I'm the same way. Like I just feel like I constantly want to make plans and like sometimes people aren't down and like obviously I need my downtime too. But everyone is just in such a mood to like, yeah, let's do that tomorrow. Let's go to the park. Like, oh yeah, next, let's go to Justin Bieber concert next week. Like, let's go. I love it. I love this energy. I'm a little tipsy right now. 
I had such a lovely night and I hope you guys enjoyed my video today. The lightning one, it was so funny. Me and Luke, who's Ryan's roommate, one of my best friends from high school, were the only ones in the bar that were like, let's go lightning. Luke was literally chirping people. I was like, what are you doing? We are full of rangers people right now, but it was fun. <laughs> um, Ryan's a rangers fan now, whatever. He literally cheered for lightning last year, but whatever. I'm happy for him that he wants to like cheer for his new city. It's very sweet. <sighs> I'm gonna drink like whatever you get and go to bed because tomorrow morning at 9.30 a.m. I have a workout with Katie actually. It's a big Katie vlog. I had so much fun today with her and Colby. And then tomorrow, yep, Katie and I have our workout and I'm doing something that I've never done in New York City before tomorrow. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. There's gonna be another vlog tomorrow. So subscribe. I'm posting for the next two weeks starting yesterday. So this is day two. Day three will be coming out tomorrow, obviously. I love you guys so much. Thanks so much for making this possible, for this to be my life, and for following along, and just always being so supportive. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night.